Hello, I hope you're well. Welcome to another reading. Let's see what we have today. I do have uh, a couple of, well, about four uh, short messages channeled and uh, then we'll get straight into it. Uh, but there's something you're building and uh, you don't want it to fall down this time. So I think that's the theme. But what we're going to do after that is get some, uh, my new cards here. And I've got these little easels and we're going to get the theme of the reading and then we'll go from there. Okay, so I got the song New Moon on Monday uh, by Duran Duran in my head, which I was a Durani. So there's something about the new moon. Um, I keep seeing New Moon on Monday. I can't remember the other lyrics. Uh, I stayed the whole day like a lonely satellite. Something like that. Look up the uh, lyrics. Um, but new moon and it's new moon on Monday. Yeah. So, and then I got, it's lonely at the top. You need some friends, people you can trust, apparently. Three's a crowd, so walk away and don't be involved anymore for your own sake. So there's some sort of relationship that needs to let go or some hanging around and trying to get this ex back. No. It's uh, t time to move on. Keep building. It won't fall down this time. I don't know if this person was part of your business as well, but you need to let them go and completely make it your own. Interesting. So let's get these cards. If you would like a personal reading uh, from me, uh, you, the link's in the description. You can check it out on um, Paper Bell. I offer some different readings. Please remember this is general reading. It's not going to resonate with everyone. Okay. And uh, it's a collective reading. And if there's anything about, you know, health, mental health, finances, career, legal, whatever it is, please go and get professional advice before you take any here. Entertainment purposes only, as they say. Sorry, I have to say that, but it's part of it. Oh, some mischief around. <laughs> Ooh. Somebody shouting, shouting and gossiping. So we're going to put that on this one, these little easels. I've got three of them. Okay. Number 44 may be of relevance. Puka. Mischief. Somebody shouting at the top of their voice or maybe shouting at you. Maybe shouting and you're, they're not listening to you. That's all for my guide. Um, okay. Blessings are coming in though. Count your blessings. You may have to do some gratitude. And I know how hard that is when you're feeling down and you feel like you've lost everything. But unfortunately, it's the way through. So the same. <laughs> um, no, it is. And mystery. So you may have secrets to reveal. There may be some hidden project and they're asking you to keep a secret about it at the moment. Don't tell anyone. Right, they want one more, but I haven't got another easel. Okay, respect Anubis. So I'm going to put that. Oh, no, it's to go there. I need another easel. <laughs> okay, so... That is the theme of the reading. They want me to go to the moon cards here, which is interesting. What are we getting? Who's causing this mischief? What's happening? Not having respect for you. Uh, you may be having a go at yourself. Um, there's a lot of fear here. This is the wa waxing gibbous moon. fear of uh, it's almost like you were trapped in a cage with a lot of feelings and emotions and you got used to it now you've come out of the cage and you're a little bit fearful you want to go back in i don't know where that's come from but that's what i'm getting because there's a lot of chaos and fear around you you don't know what's coming next it's uncertain a relationship has ended here um but they're gently nudging you, trying to get you to go forward. You're free from this cage now. And it, it I don't think when you've got the um, the freedom that it was exactly as you planned or exactly as you wanted. 
but you've got the freedom now and you have to just keep going until uh, you get it where uh, you want it to be. And influences of the moon that's just passed. It was a sturgeon moon and uh, causing a lot of... Uh, you always get it's three weeks or so after it causing trouble, a bit of chaos, illuminating a lot of things that need to be dealt with. A lot of toxicity around you. Three people, toxic people around you, causing mischief and mayhem. Through gossip, they may be whispering in your ears. It, it may be um, patterns of thought that these people helped create. This could be from family or wherever. Patterns of thought that were created in the past are still influencing you. You're still living up to an ideal that is um, no longer necessary to. These people are out of your life. Got that song, you're out of my life. that michael jackson's net now um whoa the unexpected is about to arrive um seek familial relationships as partnerships i've got um something about the moon you may be doing moon magic moon rituals but with a partner but this is more family, something about creating a business with a family member. They have the expertise, expertise that you need. This person just about took everything, destroyed your business, destroyed everything. You've got to start again and this time it won't fall. This was a divorce. Yeah, look. There are new paths of creation to follow. Family will help. You're also being guided by the universe and your guides and angels. You're being given information to start again in a new way, in a very new way. That's going to be much more lucrative. You have to let this relationship go. It's almost like you're waiting for them to come back, but they're not. They're with somebody else now. It's over. Okay. Uh, where do you want me to go? these ones these are my new time traveler cards i love them i got them the right way yeah okay What's this mystery about them? I mean, stormy seas but it's like you're calm and hidden underneath it's been a big storm you've retreated you've hidden you're not going out, you're not doing anything. Um, that's going to change. Life force energy. I've been to the Maasai Mara and I've seen the Maasai. Okay, it's the Maasai in Africa. And they are so much energy. They jump, they do everything. They are fantastic. They know how to survive in, you know, harsh climates around these animals that could kill them. You know, and they have the courage of a lion, really. And that's what you're being asked to have. Get your life force energy back, that spring. Exercise. Get out and exercise. You've got to get out of this. You've been in a very um, depressed state, really. Please, you know, go and talk to somebody, even if it's just family member or mental health provider, you know, counsellor, whatever, a doctor, um, about how you're feeling. But I think you've got to a point now where you, you're, I've had enough of this. And you're beginning to create again. You're beginning to create things, getting ideas. Um, I think you may be having strange dreams about all of this. And you're getting your energy back. You've had a period of reflection. You've done some shadow work. You've seen, you've gone through that relationship in minute detail to see what went wrong. So next time, you'll know. And you'll get out quicker. You won't hang around to see if this is going to sort out uh, and be better. You won't. You won't suffer fools again. Something about an egg, egg timer. Seen an egg timer? Was an argument caused over an egg timer? I don't know, but that's what I'm um, getting. I guess. <laughs> um, so yeah, get your life force energy back. The sun's coming out. 
Now we'll get the sun and come back tomorrow. But your bottom dollar tomorrow, I got that line very clearly. So it may be that you're worried about money, um, but money is coming in. You just It's this period of uncertainty that's really thrown you, um, but it is clearing. Respect for yourself. You must have respect for yourself. And I don't think you have had that. And that's how this person was able. It could be mental cruelty going on here. Um, narcissism. Something like that. You uh, you have to um, believe in yourself. Look, the sun is coming out. Look at that. Vitality. You're getting it back. The exercise, jumping around, is going to help you. There may be some sort of class you can meet other people i think this person's taking your friends i know that, that sounds weird but it, it feels like that to stick to your gun stand your ground you are correct you were correct whoever that's for i don't know but um let's have a look yeah dinosaurs this person may have behaved like a dinosaur held all the power very old mentality um ooh. i am getting you know it could be uh a monster right they're putting a light on the volcano here and then the um this uh i've forgotten what they call those dinosaurs um they're the gentle he was not gentle Frank, uh, name, um, behave like a monster. I just heard hid her food. Oh my God. Um, not very nice. False, there's violence, yes, domestic violence of some sort. And then mental cruelty or um, cruel words and taunting and um, oh, narcissism. Mental cruelty. Very old mentality. It could be parents as well, mother, father. Kept kept down. This is all passing out of your life now. One more of these. Two more apparently. Yeah, you're at peace now. You're coming into a peaceful time. Peace with yourself. You can be who you are. I think you hid a lot of things about yourself, a lot of gifts, maybe, um, spiritual gifts, whatever. You hid a lot of things about yourself. You used to go to um, exercise classes and different meetings and things, and you kept it quiet. This mystery. Nobody could fathom you. You just hid who you were to weather the storm up there. You're asked to come out of your shell now and be who you are. This is a very specific message, isn't it? Yes, because a transformation is occurring. You may go, um, travel. Stop going back into the past. Time traveling back into the past in your mind. Uh, this person just was the way they were. They will get their lessons. They will get their karma. It's been given to them now. They just don't realise it's happening yet. But it is being given to them. Ooh. Okay. What else do we have? Like these blessings, that would be nice, wouldn't it? Right. You were... Um, Whoever this is, you were sort of uh, letting anyone into your space because I've got this upside down. They're asking you to be more discerning now and are respectful of yourself, know your boundaries more, to find them more clearly, for the people stepping over them now. You've needed them to do that in the past, but now you don't. Um, it's time for you to, I mean, so that's a little circle put a circle around you uh, of light. Some people are crossing, they're feeding off your energy quite a lot. This was upside down. So it's a case of, oh, 
I'll let my hair down. I'll give whatever to whoever it is down there and they can climb up whatever and do what they want and chat. And somebody comes in and wastes your time and you want to do this with your watch. And in fact, I think you may have done that a couple of times to let them just discreetly let them know to stop chatting as an aunt or somebody like that. Very prim proper, whoever they are. It's like, come on, I need you to go now. I've got things to do. And it's almost like they're deliberately coming in and taking your time. They may be ringing constantly as well. And they're wanting you to sort out their problems um, where it's time to set your boundaries in place because you've got work to do. Okay, and you've got to look after yourself. Have respect for yourself. This is what you've been learning from this broken relationship. Uh, it was always going to break, okay? And hard, hard to hear, but, and it's, hey, I've been through it. I had a divorce, I know. And mine was always going to break, but um, don't let any Tom, Dick and Harry come in and take your time. Be discerning. Yeah, and get some more rest. Yeah, you need rest. Yeah, because you, you're blessed. Oh, oh my, a little easel there has gone. Because you've got your um, blessings coming in. It's the Emerald City, getting everything you want. You've got to follow the right path. You know exactly what to do, how to start again. And this time it will fall. Oh, I'm putting the wrong one up. Blessings are coming in. The money will come in. You know exactly what to do to get it. The flow. Get into the flow uh, with your time, your money. Some of you have had time off work because of this. It's time to get back and get going. It's, it's time because it's all going to flow in now. The ideas are there. The transformation is taking place. Somebody's been sick a lot. As in physically sick. You're not pregnant, Joanne. <laughs> I get a couple more of these and then we'll round this off. Yeah, look, barrier. That's our path again. Get back on the path. You were taken off the path and distracted. Get back on the path. Hold to the moon. I think you do a moon ritual or you do moon spells or you cleanse your crystals by the moon. Something to do with the moon here. Yeah. Do not be impulsive with your love relationships. It's been um, boundaries in place. You do not let anybody cross that line who isn't respectful of you and who isn't going to give equal time and measure back. I'm getting it's that flow getting in that flow look at the water flowing that's the past you've got to start to try and let go of the past and what happened that flow that upset that broken heart and the heart is mending now six people are going to come into your life you will get the master key to your heart if you don't watch only one is deserving and he will make himself quite clear. He or she. Okay. Yeah. Um, look, I don't know if you're going to make money when you're asleep. Look at these um, fishies here. You may be doing that. Um, there may be some passive income happening when you are asleep. You're getting downloads. You're being shown. Your heart's being restarted. They're showing me. <laughs> you know with it. Look. Uh, um, lying there your heart's being restarted um you can love again it's safe to love again and the money's the money's coming in the next two weeks is definitely there's a check landing in the post type thing um money put into your account i think you've been underwater with emotions too much emotion it's made it's physically sick at times i think it's time to stop please get help if you need that okay um at night especially you you spend a lot of time crying at night in this relationship and they're trying to bring in your life force again and get get you going um there are going to be people coming there are a lot of people interested in you already and are whoa she's back on the market i'm getting a she 
but you know you can change that round relevant to you um back on the market and they're going to be oh that's an awful term <laughs> but you know what i mean so um but there's something about um somebody in your dreams they may have shown themselves to you already through your dreams you like a telecom telecommunication <laughs> tele telepathy type thing um you may have dreamt about the person that you've dreamt about not your ex but there'll be a person you dream about and they're going to be the one but there'll be six around you and you'll deviate don't get your heart broken again okay last card yes everything on this path as long as you stick this path which is in um quite a few cards we've got a path here a path here now where else did i see and the ultimate path here so you've got to stick to this path and believe in yourself it's the only way you're going to get to your destination beware of the distractions and the temptations that are put on your path by other people who have hidden agendas okay right well i hope that's been of some use for you uh i hope you'll um subscribe and join me on the world uh messages channel uh that i have i've just done i've done quite a few videos this week uh for that and yeah if you want a personal reading you want any coaching anything like that all the links are in the description okay Take care of yourselves and I shall see you next time. Bye.